right, right there, right underneath. Oh, it's a large oh, it's a nice mouth. large one. Nice large one. Boy, nice he ate that one. Man, he ate that sucker, Jerry. Oh, mackerel. That's the right I don't attitude. See, I don't see nothing in his mouth, man. <laughs> I don't yep, see there we go. Got him. Got him. Just a regular. No size. That's just a couple pounds. Fun one. Fun one. I think it might, you know, is it large or small? It's large. It's large. Largey. Holy smokes. You liked that sucker, didn't you? Oh. You think you wanted to eat that bait? <laughs> Look at that. Just another nice one, but boy, oh boy, are they nipping. Look at that, just the back hook again, huh? Fat, so it's little head, big body. That is a really, really beautiful largemouth. I'm loving it, I'm loving it. <laughs> he ate that baby. Wow. You know, it's always a good thing to be one of the first ones on your favorite lake to fish one of the newest, hottest baits out on the market. What does it mean? It means fish like this chewing on something that they've never seen before. And one of the hottest baits around, or to come around in a long time, is the scatter wrap. Rappelous scatter wraps have one of the most revolutionary design concepts I've seen in years. Their wide saddle shake bill is the driving force behind our unique scattering action. At slow to moderate speed, scatter wraps run straight and true, but once they reach a certain speed, they begin to veer erratically from one side to the other, imitating a panic bait fish before returning to a straight path. Speed is the primary factor determining the degree of scattering action. The faster you move them, the more dramatically and often they scatter. There's a scatter wrap minnow, a shad, a crank, and even a scatter wrap countdown that sinks when paused and then swims back at a desired depth. Each model has a different profile to match common forage species. These baits unlock a whole new dimension to presentation. Oh, he's got company, Al. He's got company down there. What? Big brown. Is it? Yep, big brown. There's two or three with him. Look at him. See him? He's trying oh, to yeah, grab it. He wants that scatter wrap. Oh, I almost, oh, I almost had, doubled. I had the other one on it. <laughs> I almost said two on one. That's a good bait. Yeah. That is a really, really, really <laughs> nice fish. Look at that. Crunched it. Crunched it first spot of the morning. Come here. Look at the size of this brown right here, huh? <laughs> Man, it's amazing, isn't it, how that that action that's just built built right in, you know, a lot of crankbaits here, just constantly pumping the rod and using mechanical action to make the lure work, but this particular one, man, it's just off to the side, 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 you can see right there, I had one grab it, the other one wanted it, really is magical. Wow, wow, wow.